Plasticity and Rhino are both 3D modeling tools, but they serve different purposes and user bases. Plasticity is designed for concept modeling and hard surface design with a clean, intuitive interface. It's built around precision and speed using direct modeling and CAD-like workflows. If you're into industrial design or quick iterations for product concepts, plasticity feels fast, fluid, and easy to pick up. Rhino, on the other hand, is a powerhouse for versatility. It supports NURBS, Mesh, and sub-D modeling and integrates well with plugins like Grasshopper for parametric design. Architects, engineers, and designers use Rhino when they need robust geometry tools, scripting, and interoperability with other platforms like Revit, Blender, or CAD software. If you want fast, elegant modeling without complexity, plasticity shines. But if you need detailed control, complex geometry, or advanced plugins, Rhino remains the go-to choice. Price and learning curve also matter. Plasticity is simple and more affordable, while Rhino is more feature-rich but heavier.